I think a lot of people kind of expect you to be fighting in February in Australia. So what brings you to the sunny shores of Orlando? Um, they offered me the fight. And uh, yeah, February is... Uh, that means camp would have to be over Christmas and uh, and New Year's. And uh, I wanted to spend Christmas with my son. And, uh, yeah, it popped up and I thought it was a great opportunity to uh, get paid and, and uh, enjoy Christmas. Nice. Plus, you get to enjoy Perth as a fan now. Oh, definitely. I'll be there. It, obviously, it, I'd love to fight in front of the Australian fans, but I've been pretty active, so... <laughs> I'm uh, I'm keen to finish the year off uh, with a bang, get back in the winning column, and then have a bit of a rest. I want to talk to you about your fight with Cyril because it was a great fight. It was a crazy atmosphere, and it's probably one of the most unique fights you'll ever have. You, you didn't win the fight, but is that one you can come away with being like, I know he's one of the best in the world, and I, I nearly had him out of there, so that proves I am as well one of the best in the world. I think my my style of fighting is. Uh, if I go out there and give it my all, win or lose, I can walk away with my head held high. And I felt like I gave it all I had and uh, I just wasn't the better fighter on the night. Uh, and Cyril was. And that's just how this sport goes. You win or you lose, you know, and I lost. When you look at this one on Saturday, I'd probably you would argue he doesn't have sort of the same movement as Cyril. So what are you expecting out of your, your fight on Saturday? You're expecting maybe just a bit more like the Derek Lewis fighter stand there and bang him out sort of scrap? Well, yeah, that's um, that's the the narrative of it. I think uh, I suppose that's why they offered him to me. <laughs> Everyone must be scared of him. So um, I uh, I accepted the fight, and then I I didn't really know who it was, and then I looked, and I think it's going to be a great fight for the fans. I come to to entertain the fans and and put on a show, and I think that's what me and Sergey are going to do on the weekend. You mentioned you think maybe other guys are scared of him. When was the last time you were scared of a fight? <laughs> I'm not scared of fighting. That's for sure. I guess that might be the answer. Did you see his fight with Derek Lewis? Uh, yeah, I watched it. Um, I watched it once I found out. I didn't watch it live. I don't really watch fighting, as you know. But uh, yeah, he uh, there was a bit of an early stoppage. You know, I think. I think the we're, we're we're big boys. We're professional. I think uh, it should get called when you're out. But he rocked him. Yeah, there there was no there's no ifs or buts about that. So he's got some power, and he and Derek was definitely on on wobbly legs. You always get asked about other guys in division, so I don't want to do that. But you know they're talking about Francis John in in March. Are you at least happy that the top of that division is finally getting some clarity that they're moving towards a solution? Couldn't give a fuck. I, I, I come here to get paid, uh, feed my son, feed my family. Uh, whatever they do is their business. So I don't know. I, I, <laughs> I don't know who even the, the, the numbers are, you know what I mean? So I just I just rock up and get my money and go home. Sure. So the plan is go out there, get a bonus, Christmas with a kid. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Sorry, back here. We got two Bam Bams on this card. I asked Brian about what they could do for like a friendly settling to uh, to get this sorted. Who gets the rights to the Bam Bam nickname? He suggested a pizza eating contest because he's not going to go for shoeies Sunday morning pizza eating contest. How does that sound? Pizza eating contest. That's what he wow. said. Wow, I feel like he's got an upper hand because he wouldn't have said just pizza. All right, I'll go beer and pizza. I'll let him know. Set it up Sunday morning. Done. I'm on. Awesome. Good luck. Sweet. If you do get a quick knockout, th there's no chance that you fight in Australia or in Perth? Nah, uh, look, I'm more excited to be pissed by the side of the ring than, uh, than starving myself over Christmas, you know what I mean? Um, Christmas is a time for family and I've been away from home for a long time now and I think uh, that's, that's the one thing I'm very excited about. So, sorry Australia, but I'll be there in the crowd. I'll be hyping up from the crowd.